everyone. A very happy Chinese New Year to all. My name is Kim Lin. To me, Chinese New Year is a very significant period in my life that always reminds me of an incident that shaped my destiny. This is my story. I love my father. I love my brothers. I love my grandfather. I love all because I follow the teachings of Bhagavan Baba. People of those days 
were happy and joyous. who sought his wisdom, love him and misfortune of the nation, as well as other members. Suddenly, King Lu felt that his father, who was back home in another province, was not well. Trusting this instinct, he resigned from his position and ran all the way home. Please spare my father's life. Oh. 
Take my life. Take my life. Spare my father's life. Please take my life. Take my life. Spare my is the story of Yet Fanny, a great soldier who lived in the Song Dynasty. One day, the young princess of the mighty king who ruled the land during that period was passing through the forest with her maids. Without waiting and without thinking of his own safety, he in armed with only 
Peter Steele fought the beast. It was a gruesome battle. He only thought of his own safety. The ferociousness and shots of Indian finally scared the beast away. The father carried the son who was smeared with blood. Indian, with his last breath, said, You are safe. In him died. Feel our piety. This was what we believe. This is the great and grand teaching of the Chinese civilization.
son of the great kings who ruled China well, Him Tang Yao he divided the four seasons into 24 divisional points and was the first king to allow younger people to take positions of power. Emperor Shang Tang founded the Shang Dynasty. He loved his people so much that when the drought hit the country, he prayed to God to punish him and not the people. His sincere prayers brought the rain and saved thousands of lives from the great calamity of the severe drought. The first emperor who unified fragmented China was Emperor Shi Huang of the Qing Dynasty. He abolished aristocratic feudalism and brought cultural development and was hailed as a great contributor to Chinese civilization. Emperor Wu Di of the Western Han Dynasty, in his 53 years of reign, brought the golden age of the Chinese history with his skillful and bold visionary contributions. Emperor Taizong Han Dynasty, one of the most powerful kings who ruled China, brought again the golden years. Wu Zetang, the only empress in China's history who was strong and powerful, and she kept unified China moving in visionary directions. The South Pointing Carriage, hailed as the first automation in human history, was invented 1,000 years ago before the compass was invented during the Chao Dynasty. China produced refined paper on which the history of Chinese and all other civilizations were destined to be written on. During the Tang Dynasty, China gave the world gunpowder, which was widely used in fireworks, mining, railroad building, and tunnel digging. China gave the world the first mechanical clock and invented the first seismograph for the detection of earthquakes during the Eastern Tang Dynasty. Chinese sailors discovered America even before Christopher Columbus and China produced the first scale maps drawn on silk. Abascus, the earliest form of the modern calculator, was invented 1,700 years ago during the Han Dynasty. China was the first civilization in the world to mine and exploit coal, the first to produce silk material which was exported to the rest of the world. The Chinese practice greenhouse culture to cultivate vegetables during the Tang Dynasty 1,000 years earlier than the Europeans. Pottery embroidery, calligraphy, Chinese musical instruments. The Great Wall of China stands at one of the wonders of the world. This and many other architectural monuments are the pride and beauty of the Chinese civilization.
Thank you. 
I enjoyed your festival so very much and I wish everybody, the Chinese people and everybody such a you know wonderful new year. It was full of love these two days and I live here so for seven years I've experienced many many festivals but this was very special for me and that's why I stopped you to tell you. Thank you very very much.